Welcome to the Week 12 Fantasy Baseball Circle of Trust. I'm the Baseball Genius. White Sox DH Adam Dunn enters the Circle of Trust. With a six-game home slate, Dunn should be back in the lineup. The big donkey is my pick to clip. You can put it on the board. Yes. Happy Father's Day. Cubs catcher Giovanni Soto enters the Circle of Trust. The numbers aren't very good, but a three-game set in the launching pad of the Z that is U.S. Cellular Field and a three-game set with the Royals makes Soto worth the risk. Mets outfielder Jason Bay enters the circle of trust. With seven hits in his last five contests, hopefully Bay is starting to finally heat up. Playing in AL Parks this week in Oakland and Texas may save Bay some playing time. Bay has a career 1.028 OPS in Oakland. Moving to pitchers, Giants starting pitcher Madison Bumgarner enters the circle of trust. Two home starts on Tuesday versus the Twins, and Sunday he takes on the Indians. 11 straight starts of three earned runs or less show Baumgartner's 3-8 record isn't indicative of how well he's pitched this season. White Sox starting pitcher Gavin Floyd enters the circle of trust. Two home starts this week on Monday with the Cubs, and Sunday he takes on the Nationals. Floyd has held Cubs hitters to a 146 batting average in two career starts, and he owns a 367 career ERA in five appearances against the Nationals. Rangers starting pitcher Derek Holland enters the circle of trust. He's got two home starts this week on Monday with the Astros, and on Sunday he takes on the Mets. He's 2-0 with a 6.68 ERA in six home starts this season, which is concerning, but he hasn't had a home start since May 24th. I'm willing to roll with Holland this week. That's the Week 12 Fantasy Baseball Circle of Trust. I am the Baseball Genius. If you want to see more of my work, you can go on thebaseballgenius.com, and if you want to follow me on Twitter, I am a baseball genius.